Hey everybody and welcome back to the channel. If it's your first time on my little channel that just now hit 45 subscribers, a big, a double thank you for stopping by. I greatly value every single view, every single subscriber I get on this channel because if you haven't heard yet, my main channel, the one that had almost 2,600 subscribers and almost 1,800 videos, was taken down by YouTube. Probably for uh, sharing a little too much uh, Carrie Lake facts. And yes, I am definitely voting for Carrie Lake. Because even my dead rotting corpse wouldn't vote for Katie Hobbs. Who has a uh, a two-time racist. And yes, YouTube, you can go research that yourself. It is documented in the state of Arizona. She was She's a two-time convicted racist and cost the state of Arizona $2.75 million. It's facts. So fact check that, you fuckers. And this story here, well, hang on, before we get started with this story. Tim Pool. I know a lot of people are like, I I don't I don't like Tim Pool. Why? Answer, 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 answer me that. Why? I watch the uh Tim Cast IRL every single day. And I've heard his new song, Genocide. And I love it. And obviously a lot of people are loving it because it skyrockets to number one on iTunes. It's more of a alternative rock song. Sounds like uh, the old, old school uh, Green Day. Love it. And Tim, I know you're never going to see this because you're a super busy man, but great job. So now back to uh, this story. Now I'm going to give you my opinion on this before we even start. This tweet was on the official blue check mark verified at White House Twitter page. And I fully stand with this watchdog group claiming that, you know, by them taking this down, they shouldn't have been able to. Because by them taking this down, it's just the same as if, you know, Biden, you know, wrote something down and then watered it up and threw it in the freaking trash. Because to me, once anything gets written down or tweeted or posted on any social media from the White House. It becomes an official government document, official government post, official government tweet, period, and should not be taken down. And I know a lot of people are all mad that old Elon Musk bought Twitter, but I am loving it. I also heard that somebody started up a GoFundMe for AOC so she can afford her $8 a month blue check mark. I don't have a blue check mark. I think the blue check marks are fucking stupid. Because the way I see it, you want to be verified. Well, I want to see your face and hear your voice just like you're seeing my ugly mug right now. And you're hearing my screwed up voice. That's verified. I'm not sitting in front of some fake ass green screen. Which I don't like green screens. If you can't do what I did. By actually making your own backdrop. And if you think that my backdrop's fake. Because a lot of people have said your backdrop's fake. I can turn down the lights. I can turn up the lights. 
that is a real American flag back there. That's a real futon sitting back there. That's a real wall. I don't fake anything. And yes, it'd be so much easier just to, oh, hit a button and, oh, look, I could change my background to this, to this, to this. Well, it takes a little more effort to actually set up a real backdrop. But that's what makes me different than the rest of the people on this platform. The rest of the people that are probably loving the fact that my main channel got taken down. The one that was monetized. Because I think it's funny. My uh, main channel gets taken down. The email stop. Hmm. <laughs> So that's the end of the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. If you don't, I really don't care. I don't force people to like me. I am who I am. I know that I'm an asshole. And so be it. 2 p.m. Arizona time every Sunday. Me, uh, Fat Man Prepper and Angry Conservative do the uh, Broken Angry Fat Man podcast. Where we sit around and talk about whatever the hell we want to talk about. So, hope to see everybody over there Sunday. 2 p.m. Arizona time. And don't ask me what time it is for you if you live in New York or Missouri or something. Everybody has a cell phone. Do your own work. Look it up yourself. And on that note, thanks for watching everybody.